Well, a car crash on the northwest side killed a father of three. His oldest daughter is still in a coma. Tonight, we are learning more about the family and the latest on the girl's condition. The crash happened last night about 6.20 at La Choya and Lambert. Oro Valley police say a man driving a Chevy truck plowed through a red light and smashed into this Volkswagen Beetle. The driver of the Beetle, 48-year-old Carl Mason, died instantly. Now on your side, Simone de Rosario is back from the family's church. She's live in the newsroom. Simone. Stella Guy, the Mason family was actually heading to church last night. Carl and his daughter Skylar in one car, his wife Mita and their other daughter in another several cars behind. The church tells me Mita was stuck in traffic caused by the accident when she got the call. On their way to youth group, Carl and Mita Mason helped teach the class their daughters attend. But just up the road, they were stopped in their tracks. Exactly one day later, hundreds came to the church to pray, to pay their respects, and to grieve. I don't understand why this would happen to a perfectly great family. Mm -hmm. The truth is we live in a fallen and broken world, a world where there's a lot of pain and suffering that make no sense and that can't be explained. The church tells me 48-year-old Carl had been battling cancer, just diagnosed this summer. Maybe. He was going to die from that. God didn't want him to suffer from that. He died instantly in the crash, but his daughter Skylar, about to enter her senior year at Ironwood Ridge, is clinging on at UAMC in a coma. The church says doctors tell them her brain is swelling and her eyesight is failing, but there is strength in their prayers. Just believe. Let's just come unified and believe. Believe in what God can do. God and the same neurosurgeon who saved Gabby Giffords. He's taken on Skyler's case. The church is setting up a fund to help the Mason family in this time. To find out where to send donations or letters of encouragement, go to our website, kagan9.com. In the newsroom, Simone Del Rosario, Kagan 9 on your side.